hello, Blaine Sundred here with race results, highlights, and updates for September. This is Deep Racer TV News. We're weeks away from the end of the AWS Deep Racer League regular season, and we've got some major updates regarding the first ever virtual championships coming up in November. You won't want to miss it. Need your fix of September races first? Check the timing in the description below to skip ahead, but stick around for exclusive updates on the epic showdown headed for reInvent 2020. Joining me today, all the way from Australia, are Deep Racer pit crew experts Chong Vu and KJ Piddle. Welcome, folks. Hey, Blaine. Hey, Blaine. Now, I gotta ask, do your Deep Racers go around the track in the opposite direction down there? <laughs> yeah, and we have drop pairs dropping into them as well. No, that's not a thing? All right. Chung, I'm told you've got the inside scoop for us on this year's championships. Thanks, Blaine. I'm super excited to share that this year's Deep Racer Championships will connect the global racing community like never before. Challenging races to show their depth of skill across multiple formats and race structures. It all starts November 10th. Our field of 98 qualifiers and champion solid DNP will get access to an exclusive time trial leaderboard in the virtual console. They'll have until the end of the month to put down their best times to establish the start position for our live knockout rounds which start the first week of reInvent. Then racers will be split into 8 groups based on their region and race their models in object of audience format in real time. This will take place inside a virtual environment in the console, live stream globally. The top four of each group advance and become a bracket of 32. The bracket tournament is a single elimination head-to-head -head format, just like we saw in the regular season. Racers will submit their best model before the tournament starts and progress through until eight remain. The remaining eight heads to the finals for an eight racer Grand Prix to be streamed before the closing keynotes. Wow, that sounds exhilarating. Now, where can I tune in to catch the action? Well, you can register for reInvent at the link below, and be sure to sign up for the AIML interest list to be the first to know for all things Deep Racer. You'll be able to tune in to special episodes of Deep Racer TV starting December 7th, and live rounds will be streaming on the Deep Racer Twitch channel starting December 1. Reinvent attendees will also have the chance to get in on races to compete for prizes and try out brand new forms of virtual racing throughout the event, including the reInvent open and virtual life races. I can't wait to check it out. Now, one last thing. If the champions are all racing at reInvent Online 2020, what does that mean for the regular season trip to reInvent prizes they can win, like in this month's October race? I'm so glad you asked, Blaine. In addition to getting the opportunity to compete in the 2020 virtual championships, all of our 2020 competitors are going to receive deferred trips to Las Vegas to attend reInvent 2021. They'll still need to qualify if they want to compete again, but they'll get tickets, travel, and accommodations to enjoy reInvent next year. Sounds like a pretty good deal. Now for those watching, the clock is ticking, but you've still got until the end of October to snatch up one of those three remaining spots. Appreciate all the info, Chung. Now, before we get into the final summit race results, KJ is going to give us the scoop on new community race features available right now in the console. Community races allow anyone to organize a race under their own terms and share an invitation to participants of their choosing. KJ, welcome to the program. What do you got for us? Hi, Blaine. Indeed, community races originally only supported time trail races. They now support object avoidance and head-to-bot racing formats. This enables teams of all skill levels to create different challenges from using single camera agents to complex agents like Deep Racer Evo, leveraging LiDAR and stereo camera sensors. In object avoidance races, developers train the model to detect and avoid obstacles, like drop bears falling off trees. On the track, in head to bot developers race against another deep racer bot on the same track and try to avoid it while still turning in the best lap time. We've had quite a few requests for this feature parody in community racing. In fact, upon hearing about these new formats, Accenture began hosting a two month long championship utilizing this new feature on October 1st. Wow, excellent. Now do I need any special admin access to start my own races? No, actually anyone with an AWS account with Deep Racer access can set up their own community race in a couple of minutes with just three steps. 
First, you create a race by setting your race details, such as name, the race dates, lab requirements, like number of trials for race evaluation, and you select a track. Secondly, you just review these details and make your final submission. And lastly, you invite all of the races you want to compete in your event through your automatically generated race page and invitation link. Now you're done and you're ready to host your own race. Well, thanks for the tip, KJ. Oh, and keep an eye out for your invite to the Blaine Tona 500. <laughs> All right, driving into the final race of the year to be hosted on the 2019 reInvent Speedway Summit Time Trial. We saw Summit online events in Japan, Shanghai, and across Latin America this month. And racers seized on the opportunity to make the championships with our most competitive fields yet. Bandi and Rezo of Team Shallow Mind take top honors, while Satusi777, JJY, and Ding place top five. Eight competitors make it through this month, so it looks like Roger Rabbit can do their signature victory dance along with Deepak, DPK, and CGS Large Lattice. Over in head to head, Team DBS is cleaning up as Haikal, Ten Huang, and Terry Lee all qualify to advance, along with Tapfer, Chronix, SK Denso, Heroiso JP, and ZLF. The Summit Circuit may be done for 2020, but there's still plenty of Deep Racer left to go. You can access workshops to get started with Deep Racer at AWS Training and Certification, or drop into the virtual circuit. The penultimate race of the 2020 AWS Deep Racer League Virtual Circuit Qualifiers took place on the Cumulo Turnpike. The Cumulo is the Spanish term for cumulus clouds, directly translating to pile. And it's sure to earn its namesake for the pile-ups you can expect to see in the challenging right-angle corners that bookend the track's signature straightaways. In time trials, HYD July Trial takes the win, while Fuchita, The Rock, MM, and Yin round out the top five. Meanwhile, in object avoidance, Yoke Boy takes top honors, followed closely by time trial winner Waka, design for team Nagakari, and Zivshu. Last up, the head-to-head -head bracket of 32. Lots of newcomers on this month's bracket vying for the few remaining spots against those still in the hunt. JPMC London 03, SNDY JPMC, and Sasagawa again made it through to the quarters, but only JPMC London moves on as one seed SP and three seed Ding maintain the advantage. Ding takes down JPMC London, and it's Ding versus SP in the finals. Now, interestingly, only five of the 31 matches this month ended in an upset. This is down significantly from the first few matches of the season, and indicates that the developers are making more calculated model training decisions in head-to-head, -head, with enough speed to land in the top 32, but enough consistency to overtake other racers. It's going to be the cream of the crop at the championships. On to the final race. SP takes the lead off the starting line and into that tricky first turn. Ding tries to hug the corner to maintain speed and ends up in the infield for a reset. SP uses the advantage to create more ground, racking a couple resets early but quickly getting out a half lap. You can really see the unmitigated speed down the straightaway. Ding keeps four wheels in for most of the remainder, clocking only three resets to nine for SP but just cannot make up the ground and SP is going on to the reInvent Championships. Join us next month for more tips from our pit crew experts. I'm your host, Blaine Sundred, signing off.